Well, good morning. I hope you're doing great. There are a few things that I wanted to share with you that um, I've garnered from my experience and, you know, contacts with people over the years that I spent teaching, learning, and living. Uh, first thing that I learned, and that is coming from my work and actually contact with people, is everything is temporary. No matter how much you work, if you are a cog in the wheel of uh, work in government or private sector, everything is temporary. Nothing is going to last forever. Second thing that I learned is family matters more than work. So you have to focus on your family. Do you prioritize anything else? Third thing, nobody always appreciates what you do because life is not fair. And because life is not fair, you have to learn how to work on yourself and develop yourself while you're working for other people. And this is an important matter. You have to understand for sure that if you're not developing yourself while you're working with other people, probably you're going to be shifted to another position that is less important to you or a is not going to give you the life fulfillment that you need. Fourth thing that I learned is when people are defensive and angry, that is because they are afraid or they have some sort of fear beneath this kind of feeling. So it is always important to get where that is, uh, be friendly with them and try to investigate it. The fifth thing that I learned is always be transparent, tell the truth, and be consistent with what you do, no matter how small it is. It should be consistent because if you're not consistent with what you're doing, eventually everything is going to collapse and you will lose either your job, your passion, or uh, the set of goals or objectives that you have for your life. And the last thing that um, I learned, actually two last things that I learned, if you want to be really successful in some sort of field, try to go to people and socialize with people who have a better mindset than yours. Um, because eventually, I think it's a quote that was said by um, Albert Einstein, that he said, you cannot solve your problems by the same kind of mindset that created this sort of problems. Uh, this is not literally what he said, but this is just a paraphrasing um, of what he said. So if you want to be a better person, try to socialize with people that have a better mindset. And this is something that I applied when I wanted to um, study my master's degree. Uh, I started to socialize with people who have a master's degree and PhD, and they took me to their level. I think there was a Russian professor uh, by name Vygotsky. In, in the field of education, he calls this as, you know, when, when you take somebody to another level, it's a zone of proximal development. It's a term that he uh, quoted or his students um, quoted for him uh, later when they collected uh, the kind of lectures that he presented to them because he was, they did that uh, postmortem. And the, um, the other important thing is that don't socialize with people uh, that are really complaining all the time. Uh, I, I do advocate for the fact that when people give you negative energy or when they bring certain kind of terms to your life, these kind of terms are going to be fused in your lifestyle and they become part of your lifestyle. And that, that is going to be emanated to other people. So try to get as much positive energy through socializing with successful people, businessmen, contractors, mentors, entrepreneurs, government sector or private sector, but try to embrace the fact that you need to get better and achieve your goals and have the life fulfillment that you inspire for. These are things that I have learned over the years that I've spent teaching English and uh, learning uh, from people in life. Thank you very much.